All right, people. We're leaving the house. You're probably my ring came off again. Oh, oh, there's motion at the front door. So, we're already loaded up. I've been doing this for a couple of days now. We're getting ready to head to West Virginia. About a 21 hour drive. It's Wednesday morning-ish, afternoon, almost afternoon. And that's what I got a I got an appointment I gotta do this morning at like 10 and I'm running late so um we'll uh we'll head out traffic. I'll probably um go get go to the appointment, go by and see the old lady and then head out. Probably drive until I get tired, sleep in the car. You know, part of it, you know, sleep in the car wake up, drive the rest of the way. We are running uh, Friday night, Friday evening, Friday afternoon, and uh, get hooked up with hotel, and then do the event Saturday, and I was told that uh, the funeral for Toby, the services for Toby will be on Monday. So I'll make the, uh, the uh, 15 or 16 hour drive from West Virginia to Kansas City on Monday, Sunday evening, or Sunday afternoon, Sunday evening, into Monday, do the services, and then we're just gonna stay out. We were planning on staying out the, the whole two weeks anyway. And we'll be uh, heading to Indy for a war in the woods. All right, people, I was close. 20 and a half hours, 1,350 something miles. Uh, says we'll be there. If we drive straight through, we'll be there at 7.30 a.m. tomorrow morning. That ain't gonna happen. All right, I got done with my, my appointment. And it just happens to be where I had my appointment. I got my pedicure, I ain't gonna lie. Pedicure. I figured I'd be gone for a while. I'd be uh, doing a pedicure. So, 820 performances. Just right down the road from my appointment. Let's see if we can uh, see if we can come in here and uh, talk to these guys. Let's see if uh, they have anything useful in here. How you doing? <laughs> What's going on in here? Golly. Yeah, y'all just mostly do. Late model GM, LS, LT, um, for the most part, C6 is enough, uh, Gen 2 V is enough, Gen 5 Camaro is enough. We do some C5 stuff, uh, some 4 Gen Camaro stuff, but for the most part, um, GM drag racing stuff, LTLS. We do in house dyno tuning, uh, turbo kits, fabrication, um, kind of a little bit of everything. And it's right, I just went and got my nails, my, my feet done. Yeah, and, right down uh, the street. And uh, I've been going there for like 20 years. And uh, I was like, I'm headed to West Virginia. So I was like, well, I'll stop by here and see if the guys are here and yeah. maybe do a little, a little Facebook Live. No. Messy today. We're, we're packed this week. We've taken in a couple this week. We had to get get finished. Uh, we've got an early week for the H Tom throwdown. So we should yeah. have a little early. But uh, but yeah, we're we're busy. Um, well, yeah, you got a shot full in here. We got a shot full and a line waiting to get in. We're, Job security. Yeah, we're very lucky. We're, we're very lucky for the customers we got. Uh, it's a good problem to have her. Just makes it a little difficult to try and schedule everything when, when there's this much. And everybody wants it right now. Exactly, yeah. And with parts and everything, I mean, every shop's backlisted and on back order. So, I mean, it's we're all kind of dealing with the same problems right now. We put a little, little blower yeah, on this one. C7 uh, Matt's car. So, it's a F1X with, uh, I believe it's a 388 KTEC. Uh, power light conversion, uh, Ford 9 inch. It's on a Holly. We're actually going to switch it to MoTeC and upgrade the computer a little bit. And, we're changing the, the pro charger. It's all three inch hot or cold side. We're going to four inch. A couple other things with it. We'll get back on this one pretty soon. Matt's just having 
so much fun with the other cars. The, the R8 is on the far side over there. And it's air conditioned, people. Air conditioned. Oh, wow. It's a game changer here. We're spoiled. Especially here in Texas, you would want a air conditioned shop. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's definitely a blessing. Matt and Bill, they take care of us good here. Well, they've got, what are them guys? Just, are they part timers or what? Uh, Matt and Bill? Yeah. Yeah, yep. Yeah. yeah, they, uh, their, their office is actually just down the street. They're not too far away from oh, us. Yeah. But, uh, but yeah, they come and hang out throughout the day and, and uh, get in as much of the fun stuff as they can. All right. Where's the R8? It's over here on our dyno, actually. We're back in this, uh, this one before, the, uh, with the Alex getting, uh, getting some new stuff figured out on us, some new ways to, to race. Have they, have they named that car yet? I, I, I don't think he's named it. I don't, I don't think I he's really named Cars, you'd have to ask maybe maybe feeling hurt her. Yeah, exactly. But yeah, I'm not sure. I don't think Matt's actually named any of his cars. He definitely he does the custom plate stuff, but yeah, this is this custom is custom down on here, people. Gotta do tunes and everything. Right now, we're only tuning tunes that we for builds that we finished. We're not doing outside tunes just because we're so busy. Yeah. Uh, eventually, we'll open that up and start doing tunes. But there's there's so many good tuners in DFW that that there's there's no plenty of there's plenty of room for improvement there. Yeah. 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 Ye
there's the guy right there. There's the guy right there. What's going on? I have made it to somewhere, Tennessee. I have drove roughly 14 and a half hours. It is 4 a.m. here. I got 396 miles to go, about six and a half, a little over six hours. Uh, we'll start it over again tomorrow.